Hi YouTube, Tim Unkert from UnkertEducation.com here. In today's video we are going to install Goland on a Chromebook. So the first thing we need to do is enable the Linux development environment. To do that, I'm going to click on the launcher here and find my settings. Click on settings, go to the left hand side, go to advanced, click on that, and this tab should expand and you'll see developers. I'm going to click on that and where I see Linux development environment I'm going to click turn on and then next. It'll give me a username which is based off of my email I believe. I'm going to keep that as is and a recommended disk size which can be changed later. I'm going to keep that as is. I'm going to click install and that's going to take a few moments so I'll come on back once that's done. Okay, once the Linux development environment is installed, a terminal will pop up. I'm going to maximize this and increase the font size so you can see what I'm doing. I want to make sure everything is up to date, so I'm going to type sudo apt get update and then two ampersands, which means and, and then sudo apt get dist dash upgrade. And I'm going to use a dash y flag so I don't have to answer yes to the additional space. I'm going to hit enter. This will take a few moments, so I'll come on back once that's done. Okay, once Linux is enabled, we can download Goland. So I'm going to open up a browser here and search for Goland. Hit enter. And I want this link from JetBrains. So I'm going to click on that. The page we are downloading from is JetBrains.com forward slash go. I'm going to click download and I want to download the Linux file so that's the .tar.gz. I'm going to click download. Okay once the file is downloaded I'm going to go to my downloads folder and I'm going to right click and cut and then I'm going to paste the file into my Linux files. Okay once that's done I'll pull back up a terminal here and I'm just going to list out my storage. I see I have Goland. So I want to unzip this file and put it in the op directory. To do that, I'm going to type sudo tar dash xvf. Start to type Goland, hit tab to autocomplete, do a dash c and a forward slash opt, and hit enter. Okay, once that's unzipped, I'm going to start Goland by typing forward slash opt, forward slash go and then hit tab to autocomplete goland and then bin and then goland.sh and hit enter. Okay, the JetBrains user agreement is going to pop up. I'm going to confirm that I accept that, click continue, and goland opens up and it's going to prompt me to log into my JetBrains account to activate my license, either start a free 30-day trial or buy a license. At this point, Goldland is installed on your Chromebook. I hope you liked this video. If you did, like and subscribe.